Bonjour, welcome back to Hello, how are you? Welcome back to my YouTube channel, Learn French with Anubhav. If you have already subscribed to my channel, press the bell icon to get the latest updates. In today's class, we are going to do Quiture Series Oscar portion for uh, lesson number 5, Sankyam Lesson of this textbook, Good Along Either Singing Oscar Fonsales, Volume 2 by Jim Moji. The Millennium Edition, recommended by CBSE, both for class 11th and 12th, Ashat Livre, published by Golden Publishers. And we had till now, we have discussed uh, the Culture Series Oscar portion of chapter 1, 2, 3 and 4. So all the videos based on this particular textbook till chapter 30, uh, 17 uh, will be uh, added to a playlist titled CBSE Class 11, G Moshe Volume 2. The link to the playlist is provided in the description box below. Okay, so that you can watch the other videos based on this particular textbook for class 11. Right. So grammar, of course, we will do separately. Hence, we are directly moving to the chapter. Hmm. Lesson number 5. The text is titled as Automobile A Chauffeur. Cars and drivers. So, allons, Monsieur Vincent, vous avez assez rêvé sur les cartes de fonds. Il faut quitter. Femme et enfant, il faut partir. So, let's go, Mr. Vincent. You have dreamt enough on the uh, map of France. On the maps of France, you have to quit, you have to leave your. Uh, <clears throat> wife and children, femme et enfant, and you must leave. To what? To explore France, right? Uh, mais, d'abord, étez-vous habitué à votre voiture française? But, are you in the habit of driving your French car? Elle est si différente des grosses voitures que vous conduisez au Canada. So it is, very, it is so different from the big cars that you have been driving in Canada. Savez-vous changer de vitesse? Do you know how to change the speed? Uh, Avez-vous fait votre plan d'essence? Have you uh, filled the fuel till full level? Essence here means fuel. Vos pneus sont-ils gonflés? Uh, your tires are they inflated? Uh, vos, uh, yeah. Ne les gonflez pas trop. Don't inflate your tires too much. Il pourrait éclater. Éclater means to burst. They can burst if you put too much air inside the tires. Hmm. Evo frein, evo far. Frein is a brake. And for far, I guess it means light, but still you can confirm. Please confirm this once. I'm not very sure. I guess far means light here. The lights in front of the car, in the back of the car. So, until bien réglé, are they checked well? Of course, these two things need to be checked well. Ne vous impatientez pas, cher ami. So, don't be impatient, dear friend. Si parfois un troupeau de vache vous empêche de passer. So, empêche. Uh, to stop. Right. To, or to irritate. In the context, it should mean to irritate. So, don't be impatient, my dear friend, if at times a troop of or a group of cows um, stop you or irritate you from passing. Ou si the cyclist rule the front the vous or to cyclist ride abreast in front of you. A breast is like 
uh, going in the same direction like this like two cyclists are going like this and the car is also going like this going in the same direction as much as I know it means that only il faudra klaxonner pour si vous voulez les doubler avant le passage de ce grand camion de ce poids qui va vous croiser so you must klaxonner klaxonner to honk so you must honk strongly if you want to overtake. Duplay means to overtake uh, before the passage of before the passing of the big truck. Gro camion means big truck. So you need to, uh, if a, a car is overtaking a big truck, then you need to honk really strong. And then you need to increase the speed and then you can just go like that and then just go straight. Right. Uh, that wasn't necessary, but okay. Like this. <laughs> I am telling like, okay, it will go like this, then go like this. It wasn't necessary, but okay, it's fine. Um, it helps to explain. Such movements help to explain better. Never mind. Does a poitour, poitour heavy gate? Qui va vous croiser? That you are going to cross. Au fond, les routes sont bonnes. Mais, comme partout, il y a des virages et des carrefours dangereux. Au fond, uh, like in France, the roads are good. But, like everywhere, there are turns and crossroads that which are dangerous dangerous crossroads and stones um, virage turns and carrefour crossroads as much as I know like turns what they mean is like suddenly the road is turning like this okay you are going like this and suddenly you need to take a turn like this that's a bit dangerous and cross road. Say the road is going like this and suddenly it gets uh, diverted into two parts. You are on a cross road, right? You need to go here or there. So such dangerous turns and cross roads are there everywhere. Attention, soyez prudent. Attention, or wait, wait. Attention here means wait, hopefully. Uh, be careful, soyez prudent, be careful. Si no vous. Il est dans le décor, comme on dit familièrement. So, otherwise, you will go in the décor, as we say colloquially. As we go in the décor? Hmm, must be some colloquial expression in France. Et croyez-moi, on portait avec vous la cour de la route. So, and believe me, take away this uh, rules, the highway code with you, okay? So that you are aware of all the traffic rules and you can be safe. Right. Now this was your best thing. Text. Time to discuss the questions. Right. How many questions are there? Eight questions only. Fine. Let's rub it. Question number one. Question carte de France. What is a map of France? So map you can describe in your words. I am describing in my words. Fine. La carte, c'est le plan de la France. La carte. Since they are asking specifically for France, write it specific to France. De la France, dans laquelle on trouve la géographie. 
the love forms. This is my definition. That a map of the map of France, it can be defined as a plan of France in which we can find the geography of France. But you can talk about uh, like this also, le plan de la France dans laquelle on trouve les routes, uh, les villes, les villages, les bouges, de la France. You can write in that way also that a map of France in which we can find the roads, the highways the cities, the villages, the towns of France, right? So both ways you can write. It's just that I, for everything I closed it with a, you can call it an umbrella term, geography, right? Like every uh, sort of this thing, land destination comes under geography only, right? So yeah, I simply said that on which one can find about the geography of France. So you can change it very well, you can be spe specific that you can find the cities, villages and all. Right. Number two, of France, les to rule air à gauche. So, in France, do the cars uh, drive to the left? Now, again, I did a few, uh, some, uh, some research. Now the question is, do the cars drive to the left in France? Yes. The, uh, wait. No. No, the cars don't drive to the left, but the cars overtake to the left. Okay, so there could be another question made by the examiner. Instead of rule, the person has added double. Then, if the question is, en France, le voit to double tel, à gauche, then you will say oui. But here the question is driving, about the driving. Right, that the cars drive to the left? No, the cars drive to the right. Okay. So you need to write in full. No, les voitures ne roulent pas à gauche. Elles roulent à droite. Overtake to the left and drive in the right. Third. Faut-il gonfler les pneus de Ford? Are we required to, to inflate the tires very strong? No, we are not. Okay, so no. One must not. Il ne faut pas gonfler les pneus de Ford. Next question is a continuous continuation question. Uh, four. Pourquoi? Why is it Pascal? Question is it Pourquoi? Because Pascal Lepna Pub Eclate. Okay, the tires can burst. Hmm. Question number five. Les cyclistes sont-ils parfois dangereux? The cyclists, are they at times dangerous? I would say no, because in the chapter it's not very clear. They are just simply saying that don't be impatient if two cyclists are riding abreast in front of you. So I don't think we can call them to be dangerous, right? Though you can get this thing confirmed, or you can yourself try reading and comprehending the passage, I try to comprehend it according to me. The passage does not claim the cyclist to be dangerous, right? Parfois, neg in negative expression, let's write jamais. At times, let's make it never. So, ne sont jamais dangereux. Right, question number six, we have casque double. What is double? What is overtaking? So, let's define it. Double. Hmm. Double. 
Dépasser, dépasser euh, les autres véhicules. So what's overtaking? Overtaking, it is to drive fast, to, uh, uh, to leave behind or to overcome the other vehicles. Okay, les autres véhicules. Right. Two more questions to go. Okay, now the question is quasi. What is the meaning of quasi? Now, as much as I can comprehend from the chapter and from the content of the chapter, basically, quasi, they are talking about crossing the road. Okay, hopefully. So, quasi. Ça veut dire qu'on quelqu'un traverse la route. Easy. Crossing. It is to say when someone passes through or crosses the road. Easy. You can write an alternate definition as well. Okay, as long as it's correct, it's fine. Uh, Captain Dana a Code de la Route. So what's there in this Code de la Route? So, what does it contain? Of phones? Uh, rather, not even write of phones, like this Code of route is every day there, right? Highway code. So, il y a des règles de conduire dans le code de la route. So they are the rules of driving in the code de la route, in the highway code or in the road code. Code of road. Okay. With this, cultural civil is asking a portion for chapter 5 is over. Let's put a halt here. Say to Kujiri, that's all for today. If you like this video, please give the thumbs up and subscribe to my YouTube channel, Love Future Number. And if you have any doubt or suggestion, may write that in the comment section below. You may also like my YouTube page by the same name, Love Future Number. See you in my next video. Thanks for watching. Au revoir. You may park along from Sailor Moon.